For this question, I am asked to calculate the work done by F along C, and F is given to me as this force field. So, in a previous video linked here, um, we saw that F is conservative, and I found a potential function for it, and I've got it written on the board right here. So, that means that we're going to be able to use the fundamental theorem of line integrals to help us out. So, let's go ahead and check out the description we're given of the curve C. So, C is the oriented curve that consists of the line segment from 0, 0, 0 to 3, 0, 0, followed by the quarter circle of radius 3 centered at the origin in the xz plane from 3, 0, 0 to 0, 0, 3, followed by the line segment from 0, 0, 3 to pi, pi, pi. Well, this is a little bit difficult for me to draw, but since I know that f is conservative and I'm really only concerned with the start and end points, I'm just going to write those on the board. And recall, we learned that for the fundamental theorem of line integrals, if f is conservative, the line integral is really independent of the curve. We only care about the start and end points. So to find this work done, I'm going to want to find my potential function of pi 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 and subtract that from the potential function's value at 0, 0, 0. Okay. So let's go ahead and plug in pi everywhere I see an x, y, or a z, so that I can find f of pi, pi, pi. So I've got pi sine of pi plus pi cosine of pi plus e to the pi. And then I'm going to leave out this plus c because the c is going to be in both of them. I'm going to get c minus c. That's going to be 0. Okay, let's go ahead and plug in 0, 0, 0. So I've got 0 sine 0 plus 0 cosine 0 plus e to the 0, which is just 1, right? 0 sine 0, 0 cosine 0, obviously go to 0, e to the 0 is 1. So now let's work on evaluating this. Well, I know sine of pi is 0, so this is going to cut out. Cosine pi is negative 1. e to the pi is some constant that I don't know on the top of, off the top of my head. So I've got e to the pi minus pi minus 1. And I could say that f is a force field measured in newtons, x, y, and z are measured in meters, and this is going to be in joules. So this is the work done by f along that curve.